Hi, today we'll be discussing sine law. We're done with right triangles. In right triangles, we're using the Pythagorean theorem in solving for the sides of the triangle. And we also use Sokotoa if the given is an angle and a side. But Sokotoa and Pythagorean theorem is limited to right triangles. But what if there is no 90 degrees angle in a triangle okay so we'll be using the sine law sine law states that a over sine a is equal to b over sine b it is also equal to c over sine c a from this is equal to b sine of a divided by sine of b it is also equal to c sine of a divided by the sine of c B is equal to C sine of B divided by sine of C. And it is also equal to A sine of B divided by sine of A. Side C is equal to B sine of C divided by sine of B. It is also equal to A sine C divided by sine of A. These are the formulas we're going to use in solving the sides and angle of a triangle where there is no 90 degrees angle involved. Okay, so let us start. For example, number 1 given, side A is equal to 5. Angle B is equal to 65 degrees and angle A is equal to 55 degrees. Let us find angle C, side B, and side C. Okay. With this, given our side A, angle B, and angle A, we may use A over sine A is equal to B over sine B. And from this, side B is equal to A sine of B divided by sine of A. B now is equal to a which is 5 and then sine of B. But B is 65 degrees. Divided by sine of A which is 55. 55 degrees. Therefore B is equal to. Use your calculator. 5.532. That is our side B. Okay, now let us solve for angle C. Angle C is equal to 180 minus 65 degrees minus 55 degrees. And C is equal to 180 minus 65 minus 55, that is 60 degrees. Alright, that is angle C. Now, let us solve for side C. We cannot use here Pythagorean theorem. This is not a right triangle. So, instead of using Pythagorean theorem, let us use the sine law. Side C is equal to A sine of C divided by sine of A. And... C will be equal to 5.286. That is our side C. Side B is 5.532 and angle C is equal to 60 degrees. I hope you can follow. For example, number 2 given, side B is 10 centimeters, side C is 8 centimeters. And the angle B is equal to 40 degrees. Let us find side A, angle A, and angle C. With this given, we can find side or angle C. Angle C can be solved using sine of C is equal to C sine of B divided by side B. Then we have sine of C equal to C, which is 8, and then sine 
of B, which is 40 degrees, divided by side B, which is 10. Then C is equal to sine to the negative 1 of the quantity 0 0.514. Zero point five one four. So angle C now is equal to thirty point nine four six nine four six degrees. That is angle C. And let us solve for angle A is equal to one hundred eighty degrees. Minus 40 degrees minus 30.946 and A is equal to 109.054 degrees. That is your angle A. And finally, we may solve for side A. Side A is equal to B sine of A divided by sine of B. And side A is equal to 14.705 centimeter. That is our side A.